Hey, what's going on guys? And today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create the perfect world for a hub spawn. So I'm not gonna actually show you guys how to build a good spawn. I'm not gonna show you anything like that, but actually the settings for it and probably one of the best hub plugins out there. So the plugins that you're gonna need are in the description. They're Multiverse Core, Void World, and this is probably better off for those people who wanna build a hub spawn that has like outdoors and it's not actually inside of a building but people can actually see the sun, those kind of hub spawns. But it also works for the indoor people, the indoors hub people. But the plugins that you're gonna need are in the description and those plugins are Multiverse Core, Void World, Anti-Void, and then the really cool hub plugin that I like is in the description called Super Hub. And once you have all those plugins installed and dropped in your plugins folder, the next thing that you wanna do is you're gonna wanna type the command slash MV create and then you're gonna have to give this new world a name so I'm just gonna call this the hub world so you guys can call it anything like hub I guess yeah that works and then the next thing that you want to do is you want to type normal because we don't want it to be nether or anything like that and then dash G space void world with a capital V and capital W so this will make sure that the rest of the world is void it has no grass or anything like that and hit enter so now it's done and we can teleport to that world by typing slash mvtp the hub world and now it's going to ask you to confirm it because there's actually nothing there so it's kind of dangerous i guess and just type slash mv confirm so that'll teleport us here and we're probably going to fall so make sure you just fly to the sky and if you fly high enough then you'll get rid of the black which is really annoying so this is a good spot right here and you're going to also probably want to get world edit because when we create the hub world there'll be nothing there and we're going to have to create some sort of structure to actually stand on so yeah so like i said you're probably going to want world edit just to have a structure to stand on and then the command that you can easily type slash slash cyo one space one space one and hit enter so I'll create a little something something we can just stand on and build off of. So this is just where you come in to create your own hub. Try to be original. There's a lot of hubs that you can actually download online. But originality is key to a successful server. So I'm just going to create a little small hub or download one real quick. Okay, so I have my hub now. And I hate to say it and I hate to be a hypocrite, but I actually got this online. So yeah, so like I said, originality is key and probably the best idea for you, but you can always just get a hub. So next thing that we want to do is we want to set the spawn point location for this world. So just type the command slash nv set spawn. Bam, there we go. So now actually if our players decide to just jump off, they'll be sent back there. Bam. Here we go, we were sent back here, pretty cool. That's the anti-void plugin for you. So if you guys don't want the really cool hub plugin that I included in the description for you, then you can just set the settings for yourself that the plugin has. So the settings that I'm talking about is like PVP off, weather off, uh, peaceful mode, no monsters, stuff like that. So that's stuff that you can actually set with Multiverse Core. So if you go inside the Multiverse Core folder and you open up the worlds.yml and you scroll down, you find the name of your world and yeah, you can basically just change the settings from there. So PVP on false, if I can spell, there we go. Allow weather, false, difficulty, peaceful animals false monsters false hunger which would not matter because it's on peaceful but still and uh, yeah that's uh, pretty much it right there so the super cool hub plugin will actually do that for you but if you don't want it that's the settings for that so now I have the super cool hub plugin installed and it already has a welcome message for me everything is pretty much just set up already for you with this plugin which is pretty cool so there's the scoreboard which is probably the best part about this and uh, we're gonna have to set our hub location so when players type slash hub they'll be sent here so just stand at the spawn point type slash sh set hub and then there we go now players can type slash hub and it has these features here, PvP, stuff like that, and the really cool thing is over here. All the gadgets, the trails, the special, but if I can talk, particles, pets, disguises, all that cool stuff. And yeah, so you can change everything 
for this I'm not actually gonna go deep into this but if you guys want me to do a tutorial on this just comment down and let me know and I'll just easily do it for you guys show you how to set it up and yeah so that is it for this video so hopefully you guys enjoyed it drop a like if this helped you out subscribe for more plugin tutorials and I'll see you guys next time peace out